Welcome back. Just as a quick reminder, my debut novel, Every Time He Dies, is now available for purchase. All the links are below, or you can head to taraeast.com to read the first three chapters for free. Now, on to this week's topic. In this week's video, I'm going to cover how you can approach your local media when it comes to the promoting of your book. The internet has provided authors and writers with publishing and business opportunities that just weren't possible two decades ago. Now we can reach our audience directly. We can publish our own high quality books. We can now create marketing campaigns that target our specific readers and we can become part of an online writing community. The internet is great. Truly, I'm so glad to be living as a writer right now. But we also can't discount the power of our local media outlets. As an ex journo myself, I am well aware of how content hungry the news and media industry are, especially in high turnover publications like newspapers or even radio. Here, the pressure to produce daily, engaging, and meaningful content is super high. Here are some of the reasons why you should approach your local media outlets. One, communities love supporting members who are doing interesting things. Two, you can target a wider audience that you may not have reached otherwise. Three, having face-to-face -face interactions and building relationships with people in real life is pretty awesome. Now, before you go out soliciting yourself to the local media, there are a few things you should prepare in advance. One, a press release. Two, images of your books and photographs of you holding your book. Now I may film a video specifically about how to create a press release, but for now, just know that there are plenty of great sources online, just Google it up. When you email a news outlet, there are a few things you should include within the body of your email. Make sure that you introduce yourself, state why you are emailing that particular outlet, Let's say you have a book coming out or you want to promote your book launch. You also want to say why their audience would be interested in this story. Let them know when you would like this article to be published or when you would like the interview to go live and make sure that you include links to your social media accounts, website or YouTube channel. Now let's talk a little bit about preparation. It's important that you prepare at least a little before being interviewed. This will help you sort out your thoughts about your own writing process and how you want you and your novel to be presented. Now, despite all your preparations, there will be unexpected questions asked. However, by rehearsing your responses to basic questions about you and your novel, at least you will have a greater sense of ease and control over the situation. Some standard questions you can prepare for are your journey and background as a writer, what your book is about, why you wrote the book, your writing routine, and what you hope readers will get out of your novel. Reaching out to local newspapers, radio stations, TV shows, independent bookstores, and even trendy cafes is a great way to include your local community in the release of your book. And there is tremendous power in getting out there and meeting people face to face. Readers love meeting authors and hearing them talk about their work, the writing craft, and the writing life. After all, there's a reason why book festivals are so damn popular. When we build connections with our readers, they are more likely to stick with us. Reaching out to your local media may seem scary at first, but what is life without a little risk? Put yourself out there. The worst that someone can say is no, and I'm pretty sure you can handle that. We may be living in the digital age, but relationships and community engagement still matter. So what are you waiting for? Fire up Google, gather a few email addresses, and start soliciting yourself. I won't even judge you. Promise. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to my channel to support my channel. Every Time He Dies is officially available everywhere online. Just go to any of your favorite online retailers. All the purchase links are below. You can also head to taraeast.com to try before you buy by reading the first three chapters for free. 
While you're there, be sure to join my email list. You'll receive a weekly email from me straight to your inbox, reminding you of my latest video upload or my latest blog, as well as news and updates that I only share via email. When you sign up, you'll also gain access to my free downloadable cheat sheet, seven ways to stay motivated as a writer. Know that you can also follow me on social media. I'm on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Thank you so much for watching again, guys, and I'll see you next week.